So we're at what I was told was a DIY quarter pipe, but it's actually just a full-blown skate park. Like, what is up with this place? Who built this? Blayton and his buddies. Probably someone who's too jumping in right. Dude, look at this place. Hi, Sai. If the audio gets a little weird in this video, please forgive me. They got a radio playing, so got to do some muffling. So there's that thing. This place has like little spines. The ground gets real kind of hectic right here. It's like textured, but in like a speed eating way, which is kind of fun. This metal on this is actually like a really hard metal or really soft metal, so your trucks dig in. That coping grinds like butter. It's super fun for like a quick DIY. It has like good flow. It's sick. Like these guys have been building DIYs for a little bit. I've been talking to them and they're just like, yeah, this is like our whatever project. It's the same guys who did the Discovery DIY. So it's like that one was super fun. And they're just like, yeah, we just learned by trying. And you end up with just like full blown skate parks like this. Like what? Definitely um, kind of a dragon wheel spot. Not because of the transition. The transition's actually great, but some of the ground gets a little hectic. What? <laughs> Lucas just got here and fell down the hill. <laughs> oh, there's a toilet right there. Yeah, you can use that. Okay. I'll try to keep up with you. There's like a lot of little small things that they had to do too. Like this big crack right here. They had to like concrete that. Like they did a lot of extra stuff to make this like smooth. The transition is tight and smooth. Grinds incredibly well. That thing's playful. Yeah, I'm a fan. Dude, it's hot out here. What are you doing? I need some protection. He's literally, after that one run, he's already has to lay down. That's how hot it is. So you see all these guys in orange? Oh my God, that kid just sacked that. That was incredible. See all these guys in orange? That's who builds this. And if you want to get like pins to these locations, you donate to their Venmo, which I will provide in the bio. You should be supporting these guys. Even if you don't plan on coming out and skating into these parks, if you have a little bit of extra money and want to help these guys out to build skate parks for me to come skate, she knows what's up. <laughs> Uh, link will be in the description. Definitely support skaters supporting skaters. They're doing most of this out of their pocket, so any help is help. I love that he's up there. I don't know how he's gonna get down from there, but it's gonna be something. Look at him go. That's how good it is. Wait, did he just ollie in? What'd I miss? Oh, we got land in here. Look at that haircut. I know Landon's gonna get down on this place. This is his kind of spot. It's we got the little tikes rolling around, getting some. I knew he was immediately gonna holler on that. Landon doesn't warm up, he just does tricks. Yeah, I like it. My baby showed up. He's doing his first drop in. I think he's gonna be able to do it. Here he, oh, he did it! Oh, his first big swim front board too. Maybe he'll do his first switch flip. Were you looking at me when you did that? Maybe. It's hard to tell you have sunglasses. You could cheat it. They'll build it and then do front side blunt slides on it. These guys, these, they're, they're skater skaters. <laughs> that was like the Mike York, but in reverse.
I got that. Sort of. Like straight through. My bad, my bad. Oh, what? The... I feel like this thing's just gonna move. Maybe not. Oh no, it's like an alien trick. Oh, he hit that good. Oh my god, I, I'm sorry. Yes! Damn! He's manualing that rock. He did it, he manualed the rock. How? I don't know. Shout out to Kenny for suggesting me manual that rock. Well, <laughs> oh, I missed it, but Matthew was in the air. Surprise. We did it twice, so you know it was on purpose, even though it totally wasn't. Kenny, we got the clip. That 5-0 looked like it was really easy. That's actually really impressive, the front 5-0 around that. Where are you going? Are you going to that wood? Is that he said? Yeah, the towels are the best thing. Pal needs to drop the skateboarding act and just stick to the towels. A hundred percent. Oh, he's trying to really pivot it fakey that. It's a lot of running and dropping and pushing. So hard to get speed for. Matthew wants to like air up and five of us saw that. I saw him get into it right when I was here, right when I got here. As you can see, even getting to the lower side is hectic though. Jeez. 
like how they run down the quarter pipe. Oh, they're trying to figure out the best way to get speed for it because dropping it on that quarter pipe kind of takes up a little bit of room to get speed. getting stuck on it. That's a sharp corner. Oh, he went above. He like stalled on nothing. It is not forgiving. It seems super hard to skate. Skateboarding's hard. He's just flinging the most ridiculous tricks. Did he get him? My two biggest fears are heights and uh, knee injuries. Are you trying five? Ah, I don't want to do it though. Oh my God. So I don't normally do like part one and two of videos, but as you can see, they're all getting really used to that big vert wall building quarter pipe thing. And in the next video, it's like, they're really cozy with it. So like some real serious tricks start going down. You'll see, I, I don't want to like give anything away, but like, Couple tricks were teased in this video, but like a lot more get done. Like they really all get comfortable. But anyways, just wanna take a quick reminder at the end of the video, uh, in the description, I'll have a link to the uh, Venmo to support these guys who go around building these skate parks. They're literally just doing it because they love it. They're all skaters and they're just building DIYs every chance they can get. They have a new location that they're already looking at. They're always finding new locations there. The one guy said he has three that he's been checking out, but I think they have uh, pretty serious plans for maybe the next one. So if you want to donate to these guys, uh, even if it's just some beer money or whatever, uh, they're going to do it regardless. But if you can support these guys, I'd really appreciate it. I know that they would. Um, thanks for watching and a uh, big shout out to the uh, P-Stone DIY guys. Uh, huge fan.